the evening dance. So after going back and forth for months over who would pay for the levy repairs, it was decided last month that the county would foot the bill for the project. We're told work will begin this Tuesday to repair the levy at Pacheco Creek. And these pipes to the left were damaged during the flood and then you can see wood debris piles as well. Damage and debris left over from severe floods that happened in Hollister early this year. Water from winter storms overwhelmed the levee at Pacheco Creek, causing it to fail in two places. One of those breaks flooded Carlos Ascono's home on Lover's Lane. There was nowhere for the water to go, so the water started going to the sides and went up Lover's Lane and started flooding my orchard. Today, the creek is calm but neighbors say they can't afford a repeat of last winter. Right now, as, as, it, as it stands, we have no protection at all because you know, 300 feet of levee is gone. Now, the levee repairs neighbors have waited nine months for are just a few days away. Contractors are scheduled to start the project on Tuesday. Well, basically, there's two giant holes, and it's going to be filled in with riprap, you know, sort of big rocks and uh, dirt. And um, on some of them, there will be a riprap along the inside of the, the creek channel to help guide the water. Water that's weighed heavy on this community. It just took a lot. It took a big toll on a lot of us. Now, San Benito County supervisors estimate the project will cost about $350,000, and contractors are scheduled to have the work completed in 15 days, so about two weeks. All right, very good. Thank you, Sierra. There's also money budgeted for road repairs to Lover's Lane, but the county does not expect to get to those until the spring when the weather returns to normal.